Hey, what's up you guys? Yes, today's gonna be another scary video. But today's gonna be a little bit different because originally I was gonna do a video where I just like told you guys what the scariest websites on the internet were. And then as I was researching it, I was like, wait, I should go on these websites for the first time with you guys. That way you can see my genuine fear because I'm sure that'll be there. And you guys will also be able to experience it with me. So here we go. Today we are going to be exploring the scariest websites on the internet. So I did a lot of research and I compiled this list based on like a thousand lists and I picked the ones that I thought were the scariest. And the first website is called planecrashinfo.com. Okay, here we go. So basically what this website is, is you can read a lot of facts about plane crashes. You can see like lists of all the planes that have ever crashed, but the scariest is you can listen to the pilot's last words right before the plane crashed. Okay, here we go. We are in the last words section. Oh my God. All right, this one is from the Polish Air Force in 2010. <laughs> Ooh, that gave me chills. Oh my god. Ugh. Okay, let's let's listen to one more and then and then I, I got it. I gotta go. <laughs> okay, so this was in 1986 and a reporter was reporting on the news in a helicopter and a helicopter went down and she died. So this is the last thing that you can hear from her. Back up and further north down there in the BQE traffic is very heavy past the Cubs Chaos go all the way over to the LIE. The outbound Holland Tunnel extra heavy for you right now. Earlier there was a car fire at Hudson and Canal Street. It has been cleared about the ballot heading to New Jersey. The outbound Lincoln Tunnel looks a lot better for you in New Jersey. Okay, we're done here. Leaving this website. God, you guys know how fucking scared I am of plane crashes. It's literally one of my biggest fears, so that this is this too fucking much. All right, speaking of death and things that scare me, this next website is called The Death Map. And I guess this website shows you in real time how many people are dying around the world. Sounds like fun. Let's check it out. Holy fuck. So, oh my god, so every red dot is somebody dying. Oh my god, look at the numbers on the side. All of those numbers are people literally dying every second. This is giving me anxiety. <laughs> this was a bad idea for a video. <laughs> I don't want to do this anymore. Oh wait, wait, there's an option to show births. So you can see how many people are born. Okay, that's good. Okay, good. We like that. Okay, there's a lot of birth. Yes! Bring on the babies! Although that many babies is still giving me anxiety. Oh my god, you can see at the top the population changing. Seven billion people. And then it just goes down and up and down and up. This is just like a subscriber count. <laughs> is this the world population or social blade? We'll never know. Okay, that's terrifying. Let's move on. Okay, so this next website I found is called Milk Girls. I don't really understand it because I have not seen it yet, but it sounds fucking creepy. What? Welcome. Many are drawn to white power milk for the comforting certainty that our milk is the purest available. Select the girls. What does that mean? Wait, what? Okay, let's click Sarah. <laughs> Sarah's milk is bold, characteristically thick and buttery like melted vanilla ice cream. What the fuck is this? What? $125? What is this? Gargling. Purification prop. <laughs> what? They gargle milk? Finally, she's led to the gargling room where she purifies her milk carefully for the allotted time the attendant dictates. The longer she gargles the milk, the more contaminants are able to be removed and the purer the milk becomes. Ah! Oh my god, there's a video. Oh my god, there's a fucking video. What? What? By popular demand, you can now purchase a milk gargling video performed by a select number of our rich, beautiful white girls? What? <laughs> Literally, what the f fuck is this? Oh my god! Georgie. <laughs> oh my god. Frequently asked questions. I'm gonna need these. Is this real? Do these girls really gargle milk? Yes. I would rather listen to three hours of plane crashes <laughs> than literally look at this anymore. We're leaving. The fuck? I mean, if it was ranch, I get it. Okay, this is supposedly some of the scariest pictures on the internet, which I'm very curious if I'm actually gonna get scared by this because it takes a lot to scare me. I mean, the milk gargling was scary, but this is a little different. Here we go. These are supposedly the scariest pictures on the internet. Is that for real? Is that real? Oh my god, what the fuck? 
How is her head like that? Is that, that can't be real. Oh my god. This is why you don't use Redbox. I was home last night while my parents were out of town. It snowed off and on most of the day and night. I woke up the next morning and I was going to the kitchen to eat breakfast and I noticed that I wasn't the only one here last night. Oh! Oh my god, you can see the footprints come up to the glass and then leave. Ah! <laughs> I hate that. That scares me. That actually gave me goosebumps. Oh my god. Okay, this says this is a picture drawn by a six-year-old. This is Lisa. She's my friend. My mom and dad can't see her, so she is my imaginary friend. Lisa is a nice friend. Did you fucking hear that? Tell me you fucking heard that. You fucking heard that in the other room. Oh my god. Oh, I hate this. Lisa! <laughs> <laughs> if you look closely behind the wedding, you can see what appears to be a cult wearing robes and hoods. Okay, let's zoom in. <gasps> That's some Illuminati shit. That is some fucking proof. That is some fucking evidence. Oh my god. Ew. <laughs> I hate this website. A man took a photo of his young daughter playing in their living room, and the resulting image clearly shows a ghostly, crawling form of light energy in front of her. It also seems that the little girl can see it too. Could this be the spirit of her deceased mother? Oh my god. Oh. Okay, this picture was clearly taken a long fucking time ago. I don't think they could have created that with special effects. Fuck. Oh, okay, all right, okay, uh, move on. Three friends at work had a photo taken of them by another girl with a regular old cell phone camera. A freakish face with strange eyes appeared in full color, peeking through the two girls on the right. <gasps> oh, 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 that one actually literally gave me nightmares and I'm not even asleep. Oh my God. The fucking dead eye? The fucking dead, that's a dead eye. I don't know if you guys have ever seen a dead body. I have. That's exactly what their eyes look like. Oh my god. Alright, let's leave this website. Okay, so this next website is called Death Date, and I guess if you put in your information, it tells you exactly when you're going to die. Here we go. Okay, let's put our name. Okay, so I filled it out. Let's see. I'm going to die on August 22nd, 2044. I only have 27 years left? What? <laughs> Wait, why? Wait, how old am I going to be? I'm really bad at math. Hold on. I'm only going to be 56! The psychic twins told me I'm going to live a long life. <laughs> Does it say how I'm going to die? It says heat, fire, accident. Bitch, that sounds like a plane crash to me. Oh my god. Oh, I don't like it. Oh, oh, I'm going to cry. <laughs> oh, we're leaving, we're leaving, we're leaving. What is this one? Okay, this is supposedly a message board. This is dark, so just prepare yourself. It is a message board of gay men who like to give other gay men AIDS without them knowing it. Now, I'm including this because this is a huge fear of mine. STDs are very scary to me, AIDS especially. So I'm going to read one of the messages on the message board and I am fucking terrified. I'm a biker living in London, UK, and I discovered three ways of pausing up unsuspecting nakes. So that means making negative people positive for HIV. The first I discovered by accident when I was fucking a guy and the condom broke. I said I was sorry and I was, but later on it made me smile. Then I was doing another guy and the condom broke when I put it on. I fucked him anyways, feeling guilty and horny as hell at the same time. Then I started pricking the rubbers in their packets so that when I started fucking they would split. But this doesn't always work. So now to be extra sure, I go to clubs with a pair of nail scissors, a handful of condoms, and I go to the bathroom and sit down and carefully cut open the packets, removing the condoms and snipping off the tip. Then I look for guys who are into safer sex only. I've done hundreds of guys using these methods. What? The second method is more work, but more fun? I chat up negs online who want to bareback, which if you don't know what that means, it means have sex with no condom on, who want to bareback with other negs. I say, I tested negative one month ago. If they want, I tell them I'll pull out before shooting. I never do. I make sure I fuck them at least five times, and then I stay in touch with them to see how they got on. I've done about 20 guys using this method over the years, and I've only failed once. When they tell me they tested positive, I say, oh god, how did that happen? Do you think I should get tested too? Thank god for chat rooms. They can't see how much I'm smiling. That one is like the scariest thing that we've seen today. That is fucking awful. Oh my, just imagine using condoms, wanting to be safe, hooking up with a stranger, but being like, okay, I'm gonna use a condom, it's safe. And then that stranger wants to give you AIDS. <sighs> Okay, all right, okay, next, next, moving on. This one is called Free Live Webcams. I don't know why this is creepy, but I don't know, let's click on it. What the fuck is this? Living room? What is this? Oh my God, is this legal? 
Is this fucking legal? Is that somebody's living room? Wait, what? Ew, who? Is this? Oh my god. Oh my god. There's 336,000 views on this picture. <sighs> I don't get it. This one says Chip Chan's apartment. <gasps> Is that a girl sleeping? Oh my god, it says make me unconscious. What the fuck is this website? Literally, what the fuck is this? Okay, let's click the United States. If it popped up and it was me. And it was like a camera from up there. Bitch, bye. Wait, what is this? The best little cat house? What? Oh, <laughs> what is this? Wait, there's a search option. Oh god. Oh wait, there's a live feed. Oh my god, this is a live feed of the living room. <sighs> what? This one says Carol Robbins house? Who is Carol? Why am I watching her roof? Why is there- Oh my god, why is there 11,000 people watching this random person's roof? <gasps> okay, I gotta get out, gotta get out. Alright, what is this? Okay, this is called Take This Lollipop. I feel like I've heard this before. What is this? Ooh, I hate this already. Okay, let's see what happens. Okay, I'm leaving. <laughs> Wait, what is this? What's happening? Okay, he's using Facebook. This is already scary. What? That's me! <laughs> I have no friends. <laughs> Zero friends. <laughs> oh my god, my cousin! <laughs> what is this? <laughs> Ew! Me and Lauren! <laughs> what the fuck is this? <laughs> oh my god. Uh oh. Oh god, what's going on? He hates my Facebook. <laughs> me and the con! <laughs> What? 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 He's coming with Icon! <laughs> it's gonna be expensive. Hope you have the mud tea. Is he here? <laughs> Is it over? Was that it? Um, that was everything. <laughs> How have I never heard of that? I'm sure you guys all know what that is. I did not know what that was. But kudos, that was great. Ooh, okay, so this is a Ouija board that you can do online, which is a very bad idea considering I heard a ghost. <laughs> so let's do it. Ask your question here. Am I going to die in 2044? Then hold the mouse lightly on the pointer and follow. Oh, 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 all right. Thank you, Ouija, killing it, literally. I want you to ask next, okay. Am I going to die Sooner. No! Alright, how long I got? <laughs> Am I going to die before I'm 70? No! Oh my god, this is just getting better. Am I going to die in a plane crash? Whew. Okay, we're good. We're good. Alright, one more. Is there a ghost in my house right now? This demon don't know shit! <laughs> this demon. I feel like that's a nice place to end this video. I think I've seen enough scary shit today. I am sufficiently freaked the fuck out and uh, I want to go home and I'm already home so I'm fucked. Alright you guys hopefully you enjoyed this scary video and uh, let me know down in the comments if you have been to any of these websites and also when are you gonna die? <laughs> also make sure to give this video a thumbs up if you want more scary videos and subscribe to my channel right down below because I make new videos every day. And if you want to see a playlist of all my other scary videos that I make all the time I'll put a link to a playlist right at the top of the description below. Alright, my little thrill seekers, I will see you tomorrow. Have fun sleeping. Bye. Can you imagine me in the apocalypse? I'd be like, hi, excuse me, yeah. No, oh, oh. you're on fire. Okay, you're good. Where's the cheesecake factory? Like, it would be bad.